<laughs> What's up, boys? We back here. We doing this shit. It's been a while, guys. Um, <laughs> no, it's not been a while. I hope you guys liked my last video that I uploaded. Um, it was the bomb.com. You should go watch it. I'm gonna leave it down on the link below. So today, um, before I can go into what I'm gonna say, are we gonna watch? Uh, I'm gonna do a reaction. I, it, it is. Uh, I mean. Let's let's break it down first. I'm your boy, aka Salamin with Saad, aka Salamin. Um, we're gonna be watching a TV show that I've I haven't seen in like a long time. I just I remembered it for some reason, and we're gonna do it. It's called The Moment of Truth. Um, it was probably the most savage show. Like it's brutal. I mean, uh, honestly, it is is really really brutal. So, um, yeah, make sure you guys, um, hit the subscribe button and, like, smash it and hit the like button as well. Um, hit that notification, uh, because if you don't, then you have a small wee-wee. Alright? Yeah. I mean, sorry, I just have to say it to you, if you don't subscribe to this channel, you're missing out on so much. By the less, uh, then, uh, let's get into it and, uh, get all dicey, boy. Let's go out. Oh, boy. Shit, let's do it. Sparked a long debate as to whether or not to air it at all. Quite honestly, if I had my vote, it would not air. It is the most uncomfortable I've ever been on television. Asking these questions and listening. Boy, you're already making me feel uncomfortable. <laughs> let's get into it. This episode should air. I will tell you, however, that the truth is often not pretty. So here it is. This is the moment of truth. So yeah guys, basically how it works, so it's a hierarchy to the pyramid, so we start off like with the basic questions and then it gets harder, and you only got one chance, and uh, there's a lie detector, I don't know, I think on the chairs or something, so basically if, uh, if it's truth, you get to the next level, if it's false, you're done, but um, they can, your family members, they can actually tap it and then give you a, a different question, but that's the only buyout in that time. Um, but that's basically the rules. Um, let's get to it. Probably a little nervous. You think you're going to be able to tell the truth in front of all of America tonight? I hope so. I hope so too. I hope so. Lauren, as you know, there are six levels of questioning. The further you go, the harder the questions get, and the more money you can win. You can quit at any time, Lauren. Take the money. But once you hear a question, you have to answer that question. Remember, if you're caught lying even one time, mm -hmm. lose everything in the game is over. Mm -hmm. Got it. Lauren, you're not only here telling the truth in front of all of America, you've brought family and friends to support you as well. In anything, I'm, I'm up for anything. Question two. Have you ever flashed a stranger just for laughs? Damn, son! <laughs> what the? Frank. Shins from, like, seriously, I have no idea. Oh, have you ever, like, like in the, the, the producer thing, like, oh, uh, did you, uh, first question, it's, uh, did you ever uh, flash your, uh, to a stranger, uh, any nudes, like, d who writes these questions, I want to freaking know, it's ridiculous, let's keep it going. Stranger, you know her. <laughs> I flash strangers, so I'm sure she's flash strangers, <laughs> so, I think, uh, yeah, I think she That has. wouldn't surprise you, huh? Not at all. No. Well, let's go to you, it's your moment of truth. Have you ever flashed a stranger just for laughs? I'm going to have to say yes, Mark. Mm -hmm. I have. <laughs> that answer is true. Bro, I don't know what's going on in her mind. Like, this is the simplest question. And her um, husband is like, it's fine with it. Dude, like, what what are you talking about? Nobody flashes a stranger. Nobody. You have to have, like, a girlfriend, a boyfriend, not a stranger in the street. Just like, oh, here we go. Let's, let's, let's hit it up. Let's hit all the old sack. Boy, get your shit together. Brother and sister. Not as close as I would like us to be, but we're close. That's cute. <laughs> Question four. Okay. Have you ever derived pleasure when one of your siblings has gotten into trouble? Oh, that is some crazy yeah, you guys shit. Will be yeah, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> um, 
Yes, I have. <laughs> I have. That answer is. I believe that. True. And he's like. I believe that. No, no, she, she definitely. I, I think she really did it. She out, outdid herself. I think she did. What are you talking about? What is this? What, what is this? What? You're not just here to listen because, as we've already seen, the questions can have things to do with you. You do have a little bit of control. You see that button in front of you there. Yeah. If at any time you hear a question you don't want to hear the answer, hit the button. We'll take that question out, replace it with a new question. You can only I use don't one hear. Time, I okay? don't want to hear yeah. anymore. No, 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 I'm not hearing this. Why not? I'm not hearing this. You're bleeding me right now. <laughs> Two more questions, you get ten thousand dollars, Lauren. So far, the questions have been fun, but not too hard. Not too hard. Did you say you're a trustworthy person? I think so. Yeah. Yes. People can count on you. I think so. People can Question count five. on you lying. Have you ever been fired from a job for stealing money? Oh shit. Well. Oh shit. Okay. Oh shit, her career on no, the no, line. No, 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 we ain't at all. Is it gonna okay. be worth I'm okay it? I'm okay with no, it. No, I don't okay think so. I've come to terms with the deafness. So, uh, yes, I have gotten fired from the That answer is true. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, god. Her, her That's career is more. over. I don't think anybody is going to hire her. Go ahead and brings a packet, right? Uh, sir, this is my resume. Um, excuse me. Uh, let me look at this for a second. Um, it looks like here you have, um, hmm, moment of truth. Uh, I think I remember I saw your name there. Um, you actually stole money. So we're going to have to call to HR and we're going to have to reject you. So basically that's what's going to happen. Uh, <laughs> anybody it's not worth it it really is like not worth it, 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 it that show it, i don't know who writes it like those must be like some like really evil people honestly really really some badass people yes I yeah. do, do, do you like stay up late I hate it stay up late like question seven since you've been married have you ever pretended to be asleep in order to avoid having sex with your husband, Frank. Wow. What do you think the answer is? Clear yes. answer. We'll see. So, Who's all right. writing I this? You, Lauren. Since you've been married, have you ever pretended to be asleep in order to avoid having sex with your husband, Frank? It's not worth it. Honestly. Pretended to be asleep. Their relationship have is a headache, over. So yes. It's over, dude. <laughs> that answer is. He's like, I'm gonna go home True. and I'm like, just. Seven you know what, guys? What's the worst thing about this? It's like, who, uh, first of all, who th writes these? Like, the producer is like insane. But also, um, the biggest L, honestly, biggest L dudes, fellas, all right? is that they ask for their families and friends and like relatives to be in that show it is the most disgrace thing because if you lose you're not only losing the money but you're also losing the best or the, the people that you love in your life like is that really worth it to actually make money no i don't think so i don't think anybody would want to do shit like that it, it is an insane no no i i like if they give me a trillion dollars like hey you can make a trillion dollar by just answering five questions i'm like uh no because the five questions might be really tricky and it might be actually people would hate me for it so if i have the money what's, what's the point the, the show is trying to make money i i hate I honestly hate to be the guy. Like, if you're a friend with that guy, imagine how many divorces you'd have. Like, this guy would be like, your friend, if your friend was like that, was like, hey, you have this uh, this question. I have this question. I have this question. Like, thank God I do not have this problem. Stay away from that guy, honestly. <laughs> honestly. <Ew. laughs> I don't think I can make this worse than it is. Can't be worse than it is, right? This is your $100,000 moment of truth. And this question will not be asked by me. It's by a surprise guest. 
What's up, uh, yo, boy? You know? Lauren, can you tell everybody who this is? Or do I need to do it? <laughs> uh, I, I can't speak right now, so. This is your ex boyfriend, Frank. Damn, Frank. It's over. It's, it's funny. It's funny how he walked in with a like shirt and he's like, yeah. Yeah, I got this girl, man. She gonna fall for this question. They pay me like a thousand dollars to come here and mess her up. Boy, <laughs> I got this. I got this. Oh, man. She's like, that's it. This, this question is like the finale. I don't think even like after this is... <laughs> Frank has a question for you. Finish her. Huh. Finish her. And I hope this hundred thousand dollars, if you win it, is worth this question. Finish if you her. don't want the answer, you still have the button. I don't need to remind you. Oh, hey, this up. question is for oh, one hundred thousand dollars. When you're ready, question fifteen. If I wanted to get back together with you, would you leave your husband? <laughs> I'm speechless, man. This is brutal. This is brutal. Hold on. That question is a devastating question. Of course. You could course. avoid this right now by hitting the button, Frank. He wants uh, to know no? the truth, because he, he's had no. Audience, I know that this is entertaining to watch, but this is real. Frank wanted to hear the answer to this question. Monica, why did you hit the button? I don't want to hear that answer. I don't think anyone will want to hear that answer. Nobody. Okay. He wants okay. to know the truth, so I have, he can get the I hell out. I have a question out. to replace that with. Before I do that, my question to you, Lauren, is, did she just save you or cost you $100,000? Sure, I don't know. <laughs> uh -huh. One of the things that you know if you watch the program is that I will replace the question, but I can't guarantee that that question's gonna be any easier. Here's another question that your ex-boyfriend, Frank, will ask in place. <laughs> so, I've given Frank an alternate no, no, question. No, no, it replaces no the one that Monica stopped. If you are truthful, it'll be worth $100,000, and I hope, Lauren, that that is a, a gamble that's worth it for you. So, ex-boyfriend Frank, once again, question 15. She should have just taken the money, man. <clears throat> Do you believe I'm the man you should be married to? That's, like, that's even worse. That's even worse, man. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. This I'm not even sorry. This show is bullcrap, man. Who writes this shit? Why y'all well, on the show, uh, man? Uh, wow. Shows like to get divorced, um, basically. Want to get divorced? Um, Go ahead to the show and say yes. That answer is. Sure what to say. You've answered 15 questions truthfully. You've won $100,000. Uh, first of all, Frank, is there anything you want to say at this point? No, there's, there's really nothing else I can really hear, so might as well just go for it. I, I, feel, I feel bad for this dude. Like, the, the thing that girls can get away with nowadays, just like I said in my previous video, oh my god, it's it's ridiculous. It's it's really ridiculous. Ugh. God bless all boys out there, man. Y'all stay safe, man. Seriously, like, this is crazy. And it's it's not even fun. It's not even funny. It's We're just getting into it, because I'm going to show you something else. We're going to jump into part clip, too. So. Oh, good.
You have $25,000. You said before the break that you want to go on for $100,000. Only four questions to get there. Remember, you can quit at any time. You can also change your answers at any time. You like the people you work with? I do. You do? Very much. Question 12. Have you ever fantasized about having sex with one of your coworkers? <laughs> Aaron, do you know her coworkers? Yes. Yes. So, have you ever fantasized about having sex with one of your coworkers? Yes. That answer is Shame, true. Shame, shame, shame. That's well Damn it, I like the guy how he's like, yeah, yeah, I know my wife. She's like, she's top notch, man. It's all good in the hood. As long as she gets that 100K, man, I don't give a shit. Yeah. Come on, dude. Don't don't put these on, honestly, already. Because it's it's only going to get worse from this point, dude. It, it, it really it is going to get bad. Like, I don't know how they write these questions, man. Like I said, it's crazy. Okay, John? That jealousy thing can be an issue. And if it hasn't been up till now, it may be right now. The only thing that will temper your jealousy and possible anger at the question I'm about to ask is the fact that if she's truthful three more times, it's $100,000. <laughs> You're married almost seven years, right? Yep. Wedding day, happiest day of your life? One, One of, of them. Happiest? One of them. Yeah? Was it a great wedding? It was amazing. Yeah. It was amazing. All your family and friends around you? Yes. People you love dearest were Oh, there? my. Oh, yes, I know what you're going to ask. <laughs> <laughs> Question 13. That's how she knows. Did you invite anyone to your wedding that you previously had sexual relations with? <laughs> Darren, are you going through the guest list right now? Yes, 250 <laughs> guests I'm going through right now, right through my head. <laughs> you like it? You enjoy it? I do. I am enjoying myself I'm glad, thoroughly. I'm glad. Thank you. Horrible. <laughs> Did you invite anybody oh, to your wedding that you'd have sex with? Mm -hmm. Not clarifying on this one. The answer is yes. That answer is... <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> True. Wow. 13 wow. true answers. Darren, any idea who it is? I have no idea. No idea. You'll never know. <laughs> You'll never know, bitch. Get me... Give me a belt, bro. I swear, like, you don't, you don't know. You're, you're not gonna know. And he's like, it's okay. It's, it's freaking okay, bro. How do these people even come on, on TV, bro? Like the last guy at least has some dignities. But dude, you're like, you sold it all. I mean, you just, oh god, man. I swear to god. So guys, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and watch the last one, and we're gonna close it off, and I have something to comment on. Melody continues. You have 12 truthful answers. Look at me, okay? I know you want $100,000. I want to give you $100,000. There's an answer you could give to this question that could be devastating to your marriage. I want it. Even Damn. if it means ruining your marriage. Yeah. Damn. Question 13. Have you ever regretted marrying your husband? You seem a little shocked, David. Was there anything you want to say? Why wouldn't he? I need your answer. Have you ever regretted marrying your husband? Yes. That answer is... true. And that basically concludes it guys i hope you like it um share and subscribe um uploading this video pretty late it's like one o'clock here right now so um yeah i was supposed to upload something early but um i had hiccup with a computer so yeah guys make sure you subscribe and like that video and then um just a heads up guys stay safe out there hose man <laughs>
Y'all gotta be careful, man. Shit. I, I feel bad for these people, man. I feel for, bad for these guys, man. They they put investment seven, six years, and down the drain. I mean, I, our perspective of people getting married, actually, they are getting divorced. It's just, it's reality, man. Alright, guys, safe, safe. I'll see you on the next one. Make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, um, like, and share. I keep repeating that because it's very important. It's important. We've made it to 100 subscribers. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate it. Now, let's hit that 1,000. Let's hit that 4,000 hour mark. And let's get this bad boy monetized. Alright, I need to be starting making some dough so I can actually invest my time into this because it's investing time. Thank you guys for so much. See you in the next one. Stay safe. Peace.